you. Our member is me with the idea. Prosino Pita. Rita Kahesa. Shelza Shahana. Laura Asidabani. Okay, I will explain about catabolism reaction of steric fatty acid. We know uh, steric has acting carbon, carbon atom. Uh, and uh, when we catabolize this reaction, we must to activate fatty acid acting carbon into acting carbon acyl CoA. After we activate this, Next, we start uh, the catabolism reaction. Catabolism reaction of this reaction will be produced acetyl CoA. As we know, acetyl CoA has two carbon atoms. So when we break down the steric, the result is we break that we break here, 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 here. Here, here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So, uh, the result is eight rounds of beta oxidation. From this reaction, uh, we cut uh, eight rounds of beta oxidation. So, the acetyl CoA we get is one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight, and nine. So, from this reaction, the result of acetyl CoA we get is nine. And from this reaction, calculate the energy from this. Okay, sorry, nine. Back to the reaction, 18 carbon of acyl CoA was activated. 18 carbon acyl CoA in the cycle of uh, beta oxidation is we we know the steric has has eight rounds of uh, beta oxidation so the cycle of beta oxidation is eight eight cycles of beta oxidation one cycle of beta oxidation we need one coenzyme one NAD plus and one FAD uh, from this reaction Eight cycles of beta oxidation. So the coenzyme we need is eight NAD plus eight FAD. And for the result is uh, we get from the reaction as we calculated before the acetyl CoA is nine. And for for NAD8, it is uh, from NAD plus per plus H plus. The one has been explained this. So the NAD NADH we get is A and NADH2 also A. After that, nine of isocyl for A. Enter to uh, TCA or cyclus Krebs. For the TCA uh, cyclus or Krebs cyclus, we get the energy from this is 3 NADH, 1 FADH2, and 1 GTP. Because there are 9 acetyl CoA, so 9, 9, 5, 3, 4 NADH. So 9 times 3 is 27 and for the FADH2, 9 times 5 1 is 9. For GTP, 
9 times 1 is equal to 9 GDP. And we calculate the all of energy we get from this. So the energy here will be at to here will be calculated with uh, here the result of this PCA cyclus 8NADH and 8FADH2 and we get the result of the energy 27 plus 8 equals to 35 9 FADH2 plus 8 FADH2 equals to 17 and uh, the last 9 GDP. This energy we convert into ATP value. 1 in ADH equals to 2.5 ATP. So we multiply this 35 times 2.5. The result is 87.5. And uh, for the FADH2, it is equals to 1.5 ATP. So, uh, 17 times 1.5 is 25.5 and the last 9 GDP. For GDP, it is equals to 1 ATP. So, 9 times 1 is 9. And, okay, for this uh, reaction, the ATP calculate. 87.5 plus 25.5 and plus 9 the result is 122 122 this is the gross value of all of the energy we get but we know for the activated the steric fatty acid into acetyl CoA from this 18 carbon of fatty acid we activated into 18 carbon of acetyl CoA for activated this this reaction we need to we need to add ATP of energy so 122 ATP minus 2 ATP from the activated <laughs> divided so the net the result of all reaction of catabolism reaction of steric fatty acid is 122 uh, minus 2 ATP the result is 120 ATP okay. this is the result of all the reaction ok guys uh, that is the result of calculation energy from catabolism reaction of uh, steric Happy acid from group 2. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, comment, and also like. And don't forget to share this video. Bye-bye. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.